Hey everyone, it's Lori with Scraps by Sissy. I wanted to share with you a quick fun fold card that we're going to be making on Saturday at my birthday card class. As you know, on February 1st, I launched my February Project to Go and it's five different fancy fold cards. So I wanted to carry on with the theme with another fun fold. And I wanted to just give you a quick overview on how to create this card. See, it looks like just a regular basic card but it has this double flap. Isn't that so cute? So basically to make this card, you take an eight and a half by 11 sheet of cardstock. I use the thick whisper white, score it at five and a half, and then you're gonna cut off two inches off one end that folds up to make the bottom flap. Now you can take that two inch piece that you've cut off and use it to cut your oval or save it for something else. You know, us crafters never throw anything away. So then once you've got this cut and ready to go, you're going to add a piece of designer series paper. I'm using the party animal paper. This is cut at four by five and a quarter. And then on your front flap, I added a piece of crumb cake and it is cut at four by three and a quarter. And then another piece of designer series paper, and it's cut at three and three quarters by three. The nice thing about Stampin' Up! is everything coordinates so well. It makes your life really easy. So then, once all of this is glued down, you're going to take, for the, the top flap, it's three by eight and a half, and it's scored at four and a quarter. You're going to just adhere that down. Makes it easier when everything's glued down. Just kind of center it where you want it. And it creates that flap. Then I took a piece of Emerald Envy and it's cut at two and three quarters by four. And I ran it through the large polka dot embossing folder. The ribbon I use is actually Tip Top Taupe. Uh, one of the in colors that's going to be retiring. It's their striped ribbon. Um, I liked the little bitty contrast that there is between that and the crumb cake. Um, I, I also like the stripe to it. It kind of gives it more pattern. And then I took the piece that you cut off the top here and I used our ovals, layer the layering oval framelits to cut the oval and I stamped it in Emerald Envy ink. And this stamp is from the Tin of Cards stamp set. I used a piece of, I think it was a half inch by three inches, although next time I'll do probably three and a half inches um, of the Dazzling Diamonds Glimmer paper. And then I flagged the ends and I adhered this, the oval with mini glue dots to the glimmer paper and then used a Stampin' Dimensional to give it depth. And of course had to add my bling. I think the girls are going to have a good time making this on Saturday. If you want to check out some more fun folds, just head over to my, my website, scrapsbysissy.com, and you can see the project to go. Have a great afternoon. Bye.